Hey friends, welcome back. Today's video is a quick one. I just wanted to talk about one of the things that I see students getting hung up on when they're just getting started. So this is a beginning programmer thing for sure. But one of the things that I see is that a lot of you get started and you hear words you're not familiar with and they're scary, right? So those of you who aren't super beginners, maybe down in the comments mention what were the scariest words that you heard when you first started programming. But this past week, I was just asking around my kids and some of my students, you know, what were, the, what were their scariest words and I hear things like algorithm, protocol, compiler, linker, pointer. And the main thing I just wanted to point out today is if you're just getting started and you're hearing these words, I know socially it can be really intimidating when you're hearing a bunch of words that you don't know what they mean. And you definitely do want to get to know what these words mean as soon as you can, but they're pretty simple things. I mean, an algorithm isn't anything fancy. It's just a way to solve a problem. And that's the case for just about all of these words. They're not really scary. They're just unknown. And yeah, you're going to hear people who are all like trying to brag about all the fancy words they know. A lot of those kids, especially in your freshman classes, don't even understand what half the words really mean that they're saying anyway. They're just trying to impress someone. That's okay. Let them be them. You just find someone who is safe and kind and ask them what these things mean or ask Google, look it up. Ask me in the comment section. Wherever you go, definitely just ask questions because these words are usually pretty straightforward and I don't want them to get in your way of having a great time in this awesome field. So anyway, I hope that's a helpful pep talk to some of you. I do appreciate you being here. If you're finding value in these videos, please do like, subscribe, or find some way to support the channel. And until next week, I'll see you later.